In our HealthCast today, several studies are underway right now, helping scientists to get new insight into Parkinson's disease. Dr. Sonia Calareo is a neurologist with HCA Florida Northwest Hospital, and she says recent research found a gene mutation that may actually disrupt the brain's ability to get rid of degraded proteins. Well, what does that mean? Well, the gene mutation inhibits the release of calcium in neurons, and that leaves those dead brain cells behind. So this, gives, uh, this study gives us a pause and stating, do we work at the genetic level, which we know that there are three mutations, and or we work at this calcium-driven trigger pathway. Dr. Calareo was involved in actually several clinical trials investigating new treatments for Parkinson's disease. So you know, Parkinson's is a disease of motor functions, correct, as a basic fundamental. So one of the drugs is helping patients increase their motor mobility while not having the adverse events that they experience with the older generation of medications. And to learn more about these studies that are underway locally, look for this segment in the health section right there at local10.com. And more new research suggesting that exercise may help fight addiction. Investigators looked at dozens of studies concerning physical activity and its relationship to substance abuse. They found that exercise was linked to lower drug use in about 75% of the studies. The findings suggest that physical activity could be a useful part of a treatment plan for those struggling with addiction.